our summer scholars are going to have the opportunity to participate in history in the making, taking Plymouth's expanded multicultural story into classrooms nationwide. They'll be able to see firsthand what the pivotal events were of 1620, and they'll be able to take new voices from four centuries into the classrooms nationwide. We're looking at the 17th century in a whole new way. So we want educators to look at the history and we want to look at it in a different manner. We want to look at it through new, new uh, archaeology. The, the landscape has changed over years, primary sources, um, written documents, and of course oral history is a big part of the history itself. The most unique aspect of our program is we have native scholars and also non-native scholars. Pretty much 50-50, which is very important to have that native voice. But for native people, we've been in this area for over 12,000 years. And that's very important to remember. We're from here. And when the Mayflower came over here 400 years ago, that's 400 years compared to 12,000. So we're looking at how the interactions were, how the relationships were, and how things could change over time. Everybody knows about 1620 when the Mayflower got here. Everybody thinks they know about Thanksgiving. Everybody thinks they didn't know about the treaty signed with Massoy in the English colonists in 1621. But do they really know? So we're going to examine different records and we'll find out different facts today that are different from what the history has told us in the past.